Hey guys, Eric with Midas. Thank you for joining me here at Music Group TV. I've got the M32 here with me today and I wanted to kind of go over the uh, assigned section. Uh, the assigned section is a great thing uh, that's on this M32. It's giving you the ability to basically get to any parameter you decide or need to get to in a very quick way. Let me go ahead and show you how to do that. Okay, so let me show you three examples of how to utilize your assigned section. In this example, I wanna go ahead and set my decay for reverb. I want to be able to mute my reverb, and I also want to be able to jump to the visual page of my reverb effect that I'm using at the moment. So let's go ahead and get started. First off, you just come over here to your science section, uh, hit the view button, and it'll take you to this screen right here. First off, I want to go ahead and color my scribble strip. So let's go ahead and choose uh, blue. Now I want to focus on this encoder. So let's go ahead and select encoder one and I want this to be an effect parameter that I'm controlling. So I'm selecting effect params. And effect one is the one that I wanna be controlling. And what parameter of effect one? Decay, so I'm gonna choose decay. And there you go, it's just that easy to set the decay of your reverb. Let's move down to the button that's right below it, which happens to be button five. Uh, let's go over here, select button five. What do we want it to do? Well, I want it to be a mute, so I'm gonna go ahead and select the mute button here. And what is it that I want to mute? Let's go down here to effects, returns. And since I have my returns linked here, when I hit button five, it'll automatically mute those two channels, which happen to be my effects returns. Okay, moving down the line here, uh, let's work on button nine. I'm gonna choose button nine over here. I want this to be a jump to page. So what that means is, is that when I push button nine, it's gonna show me which effect I'm using. So I'm gonna select that. It's asking me what's my target for that button. It's gonna be an effect. Happens to be my first effect, my effects one, which I'm selecting. It'll give you the ability to select which layer you wanna see. I wanna see all of them when I hit that button, so I'm just gonna leave that where it is. So now when I come over here to button nine and press it, now you can see my vintage reverb pulls up and I can get to any kind of parameter I want to via my control screen. All right, guys, I had a great time showing you a few examples on how to utilize the assign section on the M32. You know, it's a really great way and, and a convenient way to get to any parameter you need on the board uh, while not having to maybe cycle through a menu. Uh, it really saves you time, especially when you're mixing. I'm Eric with Midas. Thank you for joining me here at Music Group TV. See you next time.